You got a lot of views on that? Oh, yeah. That's, that's, that's what's up, man. That's oh, good, yeah. man. Let them know. Hey, guys, Lee County Sheriff's Office. We love your support, right? What you want? partner made a traffic stop on a vehicle. Um, he immediately asked for another unit. So we responded there, made contact with my partner and explained the situation at hand. My partner was driving and he saw that the driver wasn't wearing a seatbelt. The driver, he was saying there's no way he could have saw how or wasn't wearing my seatbelt just because how far my partner was. And you know, he, from there, the driver pulled out his phone and I believe that's when he started recording to prove his innocence basically. I left to go drop off my buddy, and I said, you know what? It's going to be funny if I get pulled over, so I'm going to put it on live. OK, that's you know? fine. Yeah. And everybody on my live, you see there's eight people, everybody on my live saw that I took my seatbelt off as soon as I came into the driveway. I asked him, why did you pull me over, sir? He said, because of your seatbelt. I said, I just took off my seatbelt. He said, I'm not going to argue with you. I said, OK, me neither. The live seen it, and that's I fine. did it on purpose because I saw you guys pull over the black gentleman over there. I get the you. The, and the traffic stop ended up at the, um, the driver's driveway. Um, it just drew concerns because how quickly he drove into there. And, you know, a lot of times that's, you know, indications of that driver is trying to either bail out, try to get inside of his house before we can even get to them. He was showing signs of nervousness, um, shaking a little bit. So we had him step out. I prefer to stay in the car. I, I like, I, I'm, I'm asking you, I'm telling you to step out. Am I being detained? Are you yes, this is a, yeah, it's a traffic stop, man. You are being detained. You are, yes. Yes. So do me a favor, just make it easy, man. You can just step out. All right, I'll, I'll allow you to smoke, man. All right, come on. Just make sure there's no what separate you from the vehicle. I told him I didn't want to get out of the car. He's okay. basically Look, forcing man. me to get out of the car, so I'm going to get out of the car. I appreciate you. He's basically forcing me to get out of the car right now. That's correct, thank you. My partner requested a canine unit, a narcotics canine, which they arrived on scene, and um, the canine alerted to the vehicle, which allowed us to um, get inside the vehicle and search it. Is there going to be anything illegal in the car? I said no. Okay. Right. The dog alerted on the car, so we're going to go okay. ahead and search it. Go ahead. I just want to give you a chance to be up front with me. I'm telling you there's nothing in the car. OK. All right. He said the dog indicated there's something in the car. So my partner um, was searching the left side of the vehicle. Underneath the driver's seat was where he located a clear baggie where it had a white powdery substance. We tested it with um, an agent issue test kit, and it did test positive for cocaine. He didn't want to say it was his. He said that he doesn't do any narcotics or any drugs, and he doesn't associate with anyone, so he doesn't understand why it was in the vehicle. It's just hard to believe, man. That's your car. Yeah. If, I, if, if I don't do any drugs, and I don't hang out with people that do any drugs, there shouldn't be drugs in the car. You're absolutely right. And when so, you asked me, I said no, right? OK. Well, do you still experiment with it? Do you, you know, no, I don't. No, and I don't. And you, you guys still pulled me out of my car for no reason because I did not commit any crimes. There's no way that he can see me wearing my seatbelt from as far as he was. And that's why I went on my live. OK. All righty, sir. Thank you. I'll be out in a few. I think he ended up getting close to 30 followers that were looking in on the live video. Honestly, it's probably seven out of 10 times in encounters people are filming us. They have every right to, there's nothing wrong with that. A lot of the times people say, you know, they're, they're doing it for their own safety, which, which is understandable. Unfortunately, there was enough probable cause to arrest him and charge him for possession of cocaine. And he took the ride.